what it look like tv we are back thank you for joining me if you ain't yet hit that like and subscribe button but today i want to have a discussion on happiness i've been getting a lot of comments in my comment section about why i never mentioned happiness and the answer is quite simple we can get my answer right out the way i feel as if as a grown man i'm way more complex than am i happy or am i sad i think that is a real childish way to go through life looking at things am i happy or am i sad excuse me as you grow and mature You should realize and it should become fairly clear to you that happiness can come and go in a moment's instance. You could leave your house and you could be in the happiest of all moods. Have a little incident, you're not happy no more. Some days you're just sad. That's because once you grow beyond being a child you shouldn't even be gauging your life on happy or sad you are way more complex than happy or sad are y'all understanding me are you feeling me are you following me what makes me happy is handling my responsibilities. And whether you realize it or not, you're the same way. When things are done and you don't have to stress about them no more, your mood and your mind state is totally different when you don't relieve the stressors from your life. I'm happy when my kids is happy. I'm happy when the spread is covered at the house. I'm happy when my wife is happy. I'm happy when my mother's happy. I'm happy when my sister's doing good. It's a lot of factors that go into my happiness besides just the relationship between me and my wife. So when all y'all break it down to the I'm either happy or sad because of the relationship with my wife. You sound crazy. And the question I ask you guys is. You're not okay with me for making sure everybody else is okay. Not handling my responsibilities. You're mad at me for that. Would you be okay with me if I didn't handle none of my responsibilities? But I was happy. Because if you would be, you wouldn't be doing me any service. Because if I was happy and I wasn't handling my responsibilities, I wouldn't be keeping up my part of the contract as a man. And as men, we are leaders. And this is one thing you guys really are not going to like to hear or probably don't want to hear but no matter what is wrong with society no matter whose fault that we got here all that stuff is irrelevant when you a man it's your fault if we were the leaders and we were supposed to be the leaders and somehow we ended up at this point we have to look at ourselves and see what part in all of this that we take And if we want to make things better, we're not going to make it better by sitting back asking each other, are we happy? This is real foreign to me. I said it before, it feels like I'm in like a 90s black female movie or something. But how many people that are asking me, are you happy? You don't look happy. Men don't give advice and smiles and TikTok jokey fashions. Any advice I ever got from a man never came with a smile. So you're not going to get that from me. And I don't talk about happiness because happiness can come and go. 
emotions lie to you you could be happy you could be sad you could be all over the place and it can change at the blink of an eye so let's just say you guys this theory was right in that short i wasn't happy but just because i'm happy one day or one morning one short that means i'm unhappy in life see this whole thing makes no sense it makes no sense if you try to analyze it on any level it cracks and falls apart immediately so why do i say all this i say all this to get to this point right here if you are a man and you out there and you're worried about your happiness you are doing yourself a disservice you hear me your happiness needs to come from handling your responsibility because after you do that and you don't have to worry you don't have the stresses in life you can actually really be happy you guys are questioning me if i'm happy but my bills are paid my bills are paid my cars are new a lot of the common everyday stressors i don't have so if you want to talk about the actual meaning of this happiness that y'all talking about i can guarantee you on that level that i'm closer to that happiness than y'all would be because the material stuff i have all that But that's what you don't get. That stuff don't matter. But y'all tell me, did y'all follow me? Did y'all follow me? Do y'all understand where I'm coming from about this happiness? Just being an emotion or feeling and you can't live your life off of fleeting motions and feelings. I thought that was our specialty as men. That we had the power, that we had the gift of discernment. That we was going to use critical thinking. And living your life off emotions is not using your critical thinking. Because you're worried about happiness. And sadness. So y'all think about that. Y'all run that around in y'all head and tell me how y'all feel about that in the comment section. But I'm tired of hearing y'all ask me, am I happy? Damn right I'm happy. Got three healthy children. The spread is covered. My wife is good. I'm good. All my extended family good. Yeah, I'm happy. But I'm just not a smiley, smiley, smiley face dude, man. This is what it look like TV. And if you ain't hit that like and subscribe button yet, hit that like and subscribe button. I appreciate everybody. Thanks for stopping through. If you done made it to this part, you my MVP. And I'll check you out on the next one. I'm out of here.